I walked in the house and I saw something on the floor in front of my kitchen sink, which is usually on the windowsill, and I immediately thought someone broke in. The frightening feeling knowing someone was inside your house or could possibly still be there. Cindy Borjalt came home last night and knew something was off. Her windows and doors had been locked, but she was able to tell the lock on her window had been broken and a sliding glass door nearby had been unlocked from the inside. In her bedroom, her fears were confirmed. And they took most of the jewelry and I was, um, then I saw um, my niece Brittany's rings were missing also. That's the most heartbreaking part. Her 25-year-old niece Brittany passed away this past June of a brain tumor. The person Cindy calls the spirit of their family gone. What Cindy had of hers ripped from her as well. A silver pinky ring that says Brittany on it. And there's another mood ring that has butterflies on it. Those are the pieces that I want back. Pieces that are of no real monetary value, but hold so many priceless memories. For Cindy, in the midst of this unthinkable violation, her advice to others. Everybody needs to start looking out for each other and, you know, talk to as many people as you can and pay attention to what's going on with your neighbors. She's urging any of her neighbors or anyone in town if you see anything strange or out of the ordinary or if you have any information on any of her lost items to call police. In Henniker tonight, I'm Sharice LeClaire, WMUR News 9.